Following months and months of trickle leaks, the full specs of Samsung's upcoming Galaxy S23, S23 Plus, and S23 Ultra have been leaked online. This leak comes from a pair of European leakers, the well-regarded German WinFuture and the French Twitter leaker Bill Bilkouin. Both compare big updates, including the 200-megapixel rear camera and a 1TB storage option for the S23 Ultra, as with last year and the year before that, the base models are to be smaller and less full-featured than the Ultra models. Samsung is expected to equip the S23 with a 6-1-inch display, the Plus with a 6.6-inch display, and the Ultra with a 6.8-inch display. All three are to be equipped with the Snapdragon 8 Gen 2 processor in Europe, supporting earlier reports that Samsung would be moving exclusively to Qualcomm for 2023. Samsung is also equipping these devices with at least 8GB of RAM and up to 1TB of storage, the S23 and S23 Plus are to get 8GB of RAM and up to 512GB of storage, while the S23 Ultra is expected to get 12GB of RAM and up to 1TB of storage. Samsung has often offered 1TB variants for its flagship models, but those were limited to select colors sold in its exclusive store. This is reportedly to change this year, according to Bill Bilkouin, as far as the cameras go, the report from WinFuture claims that they're going to be more or less the same as last year, with a few subtle changes. The S23 and S23 Plus will keep the same 50MP main cameras as last year, as well as a 12MP ultrawide lens and a 10MP zoom lens. The front camera is also expected to be the same 12MP as used last year. The S23 Ultra, though, is to get a larger 200MP main camera. Samsung has always positioned the Ultra as the true flagship of the line, and that's not changing this year. The 200MP camera is expected to come with a 12MP ultra-wide camera and two 10MP cameras for additional zoom capabilities. With a 5000 mAh battery and 45W fast charging to keep it going on long hikes, the Ultra is set to be one of the heavy-hitting phones of 2023, though megapixels aren't necessarily everything, they don't hurt if used judiciously. Samsung's cameras have been competitive with the best of Apple and Google for years to come. This year, the S23 will be competing with phones like Google's Pixel 7 Pro and the iPhone 14 Pro, both of which have been lauded for their imaging prowess and both of whom ship with high-resolution cameras for the first time. The hardware's here, now all Samsung has to do is nail the software.